Welcome to 5 Minute School and in today's video we're going to be talking about the hypothalamic control of the posterior pituitary gland. Now we've mentioned from previous videos that the hormones ADH and oxytocin are secreted from the um, posterior pituitary gland but they are produced uh, in the hypothalamus. So both ADH and oxytocin are produced in neuron cell bodies of supraoptic and paraventricular nuclei of the hypothalamus. So the hormones produced are transported across uh, axons of hypothalamo-hypophysial tract to the posterior pituitary gland. And we mentioned that um, this uh, tract in the last video when we were talking about the anterior pituitary. Now, the release of ADH and oxytocin is controlled by neuroendocrine reflexes. So in the case of oxytocin, we have the mechanical st stimulus, so suckling, and we have sensory nerve impulses to the hypothalamus to stimulate oxytocin secretion. Now in the case of ADH, uh, the osmoreceptors in the neurons in the hypothalamus detect an increase in osmolarity of blood, and this results in increased frequency of action potentials to neurons producing ADH, and that happens in order to increase the amount of ADH secretion. Now to decrease the amount of ADH secretion, the sensory input from the stretch receptors in the left atrium of the heart are stimulated with the rise of the blood volume. So that is one of the mechanisms in place to decrease the ADH secretion. So that's everything I'm going to talk about in today's video on the hypothalamic control of the posterior pituitary. Thank you very much for watching.